shoulders or over your wrists, all right, and you're keeping your back as flat as you can. So, round one, we're going to start with 10 fire hydrants on the right side, 10 on the left, and then holding that bear pose for 20 seconds, all right, counting as loud as we can. I'm going to do the first set with you. Let's get set. We're moving with those fire hydrants in three, two, one. Here we go. I'm starting with my right leg. If you're following at home, good. Remember, up and hold for a second and back down. Good. Squeeze. Nice job. Good. Again, trying to get that knee up as high as you can. Stop it when it gets to hip level. Good. We're already halfway there. Good. Again, make sure those shoulders are over the wrist. That right limb should be on fire by now. Good, we have two more. Good, last one. All right, let's switch to that left side now. Again, lift and hold, and then back down. Good, if you can't, try not to let that left knee touch the ground in between sets. Good. This is five right here. Keep it up. Good. Again, up and squeeze. And then back down. Up, hold. And down. This is eight. Come on, run this side out. Nine. Good. Last one. Up and hold. And back down. Good. Shake it out. I know those things are on fire. Now we're going to hold that bear pose for 20 seconds. From the length of those knees, let's count together. Here we go. One, two, three, four, you got it. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, halfway, eleven, twelve. Are those shoulders over your wrists? Good, those knees are still off the ground. We're at fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Come on. 20. Great job, guys. For you, stay down there. All right, I want you to go through that sequence two more times for three rounds total, and then we're going to come back for the next round number two. So again, 10 fire hydrants on the right, 10 on the left, and then hold that bear pose for 20 seconds. Let's keep up this hard work. Hey, team, we are at round number two. It's time to add in some boxing, all right? So, we're going to start off with a fun combo. I want to see jab, jab, cross. Then we're going to weave to the right and weave to the left. Again, working on that lateral motion. So again, jab, jab, cross, weave to the right, and then weave to the left. All right, we have 10 of those combos. After that, we're going to do lateral squat hops. All right, so imagine there's a line. We're going to hop over, land in that squat, and then back, all right? If hopping is too hard on your knees today, I want you to take a big step, squat. Big step over that line, and then squat. So again, our combo, jab, jab, cross, weave to the right, weave to the left, 10 times. That's how we're gonna start off this round, all right? I'll do the first step with you. Here we go, put those gloves up. We're moving in three, two, one, here we go. Jab, jab, cross, weave to the right, Weave to the left. Good. Jab, jab, cross. Good. On those weaves, imagine there's a string attached in front of you. All right, you're ducking underneath that string and then coming right back up there. Good. Get full extension on those punches. Jab, jab, cross. Weave. Weave. That's four. Nice work. Good. Keep that chest up. Good, jab, jab, cross. Come on, I want to see strong punches here. Come on, that's six. You guys got it. I know those legs are burning now. Come on, that's eight. That's nine. Good, last one, jab, jab, cross. Weave. Shake it out. We have those lateral hopovers. You guys got this. Get set. We're moving in three, two, one. So squat 
and hop. Good. Or give me a big step and squat. Big step, squat. We're at four, five, six. You got it. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good. Shake out those legs. Good thing is you guys get to do that two more times. And then you are done with round number two. And we're halfway through this workout. You guys got it. Keep it up. Okay, team, let's keep this pace for round number we're going back to those boxing punches. This time we're going to work on some power. So we're going to start off with 10 left hooks, all right? So notice how my right hand is staying up by my cheek. All right, you want to keep that hook in tight, almost like you're punching until you reach that opposite shoulder, all right? You have 10 on the left and then 10 on the right. After we finish that, similar to warm up, we have those side lunges, but I want you to keep those feet out wide. So you're going to drop right, up to the center, and then back to the left. So again, your feet stay planted. We're just dropping as far down as we can into that side lunge. We have 10 total. All right. If you want an extra challenge, feel free to hold on to some weights as you do these punches and as you do those lunges. Here we go. Let's get set. Starting off with 10 left hooks in 3, 2, 1. Here we go. 1, 2. Come on, turn those hips. Four, I should see that left hip. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good, ten on the right now. One, two. Come on, turn that right hip all the way through. Good, where's that left hand? It should be up by that face. Come on, give me eight, nine, and ten. Good, shake out those arms. Go ahead and bring those feet out as wide as you can. We have those 10 lunges keeping our chest up. Here we go. One, two, three. Great job. Four, five, almost there. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good. Slowly bring those feet in. Shake it out because you get to do that two more times. You guys are doing great. Keep up this pace. We only have one round after this. You got it. And just like that, we are on our last and final round. Time flies when you're having fun. So for the last round, we're going to finish back on the ground. So find a spot. We're going to be on all fours. I want you to walk those hands in front so you're at an angle, all right? We're going to start off with 10 solid push-ups, all right? Keeping those elbows in tight and then pressing up, all right? We have 10 push-ups. From there, we're going to finish with 10 donkey kicks. So bring our knees in, back to that tabletop position. All right, you're going to give me 10 donkey kicks up on the left and then 10 on the right, all right? Driving that heel up to the ceiling, bringing that knee in each time. I know you guys are excited for this one. Let's finish strong. Round number four. Starting on our knees for those push-ups. Here we go. Three, two, one. We're moving. One, two. Good. Exhale as you come up. Three, four, five. You guys got it. Six, seven, eight. Come on, give me two more.
finish strong, Rock City. Quick message for you. Remember, if it was easy, everyone would be doing it, all right? We make this challenging because we know that's what's going to make you stronger, and it's what's going to make you feel better at the end of the day. So when times get hard during these exercises, push through, all right? That's where we're going to get stronger and get that much better. You got this.